Um, we, we've been here uh, since 1978. There's a number of motorcycle clubs in Knoxville. Uh, LE clubs, which are law enforcement clubs, um, Christian motorcycle clubs, veterans clubs. There's all different types of clubs. And we all get along. We all kind of do the same thing. We go to different events, motorcycle rallies, things like that. And we have a lot of fun doing it. You know, we, um, we're, none of us are doing anything illegal. We do the same things they do. We're not a gang, we're a club. We ride and, and have fun together, and that's what the organization has put together to do, is to have charitable events, help the community, and that's what we've been doing. Uh, we've been helping out on uh, the 230 um, Air Cav this past year. They went to Iraq, so we've been sending boxes of magazines and uh, things like that to help them with, the, with their stay over there in Iraq. So. You know, we had a, 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 a little gathering here with some, uh, some sandwiches and um, vegetable platters and some shrimp and stuff, just like any, any other house in the neighborhood, really, was having some, a New Year's Eve party. And, um, and then uh, we were um, at about 9 o'clock, um, the sheriff's department came in. And they, they attacked the house like a mil with military tactics. They came in with automatic weapons, full riot gear, threw grenades in, and, um, and then just took everybody outside, lined them up, and um, actually just kind of tortured everybody in, in the way that they did it by putting them out in the rain and the sleet. And, and then they let everybody go, and they arrested my, me and uh, Kenny. There was four people who had weapons. They were all... Uh, Car uh, handgun carrying permit people and they took their weapons and their handgun permits. There was nothing illegal being done here. Nothing that wasn't being done up the street or or at JJ's home, you know. So, I don't, you know, I just don't understand wh why they did it. They even took the tombstones out outside in the yard which were from brothers that passed and, um, and took all of our logoed um, uh, material, t-shirts and stuff like that. So, did they you know. explain why they were taking they didn't show us a warrant or anything. They just came in, did what they wanted to do, and then they actually took our TVs. I don't know what they wanted with those, but they took the TVs and, and other valuables. So the community is outraged because we don't do anything wrong here. We're, we help the community, our neighbors. We're, we're just, you know, we don't have problems here. When they came in here and started saying, you know, take all this gang, um, logos off the wall and and this isn't a gang logos that I'm wearing it's it's part of my my um, membership in the club but also it's my legal right to wear that we are um, a a corporation f and recognized by the United States government as the Outlaws Motorcycle Club Incorporated and we have logos that are trademarked by the US government again and they're owned by the corporation and we have a charter here our charter is is its own entity and if the charter has problems, then they'll pull our charter. We, we wouldn't be allowed to wear those logos. They, we'd have to turn them in. You know, who's next? You know, that's the whole thing that's really got me kind of outraged is that, um, you know, I, I'm uh, concerned about my family and my friends, my neighbors, the other clubs and organizations here in, in the community. Are they going to be next? Are they going to, um, you know, violate their rights by tearing down their walls and doing things to them? You know, we're all, you know, part of this community, and that is, that's one of my major concerns is that, you know, there's no illegal activity going on, but yet they can come in and invade your privacy, invade a New Year's Eve party, you know, a gathering place, and we have the right to assemble, you know. So I don't know what, what what's going to, the outcome's going to be here, but it is devastating, you know, and, and we're just going to work towards clearing it, you know.